Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the Norfolk Vlogs. This Good is morning. number two. There's Atticus. Um, if you haven't watched number, number one, one, you can watch that down below. We've been here since Monday. We've been here since Monday, and we're here till Friday. And so today's Wednesday. Today's Wednesday. Um, vlog number one was um, Monday and Tuesday, and this is going to be today and tomorrow. Um, so it is now. What's the time? Mm. It's 20 past 10. Um, today's plan is we're going off site today. Um, we are going to spend um, most of the day in King's Lynn. Um, King's Lynn is obviously a place where Mum drove through as a kid to get to various places like Yarmouth and um, things like that. Always pass there, always see it on the signs, but I've never actually walked around Kingsling. Um, there's a minster there, we're going to have a look round. Um, that's today and then tomorrow we are going to somewhere quite exciting for us, we've never been. Um, we're going to Norwich. We're going to Norwich tomorrow, which is about a 50 minute drive from here. Stick around if you want to see us go to Norwich tomorrow. Um, but today's plan, yeah, is Kings Lynn. Um, the weather, it's it's dry, it's fine, it's dry. It's Very not cold. particularly, it's not, it's about going to be about 16 degrees today, but it's always a bit chillier. At home it's 22. I was just talking to Anna um, a little while ago and she was saying it's literally in Manchester. She's going out to buy a fan today. It's 26, 27, what? But next Friday in our, where we live, it's going to be 27. Yeah, yeah, so shall we go to Kings Lynn? Yeah. Yeah. The reason Let's it's go. cold is because it's near the coast. Yeah, it's always a bit chillier near the coast and breezy, isn't it? But yeah, let's go. We've arrived in Kings Lynn and the lady in the bakery behind me where we've just got a drink tells me, are you ready for this, that there's a wimpy, a wimpy. Now if you're my age, well most people will know what a wimpy is, but if you're about my age a wimpy is very very nostalgic. It used to be the place where I'd have a lot of my birthday parties. It was like the place to get a burger and chips when I was younger. So we're going to go to the Wimpy later, yeah. aren't we, Atticus? Yeah. I'm going to introduce they Atticus to the Wimpy. I don't know if they do nuggets, I don't know. Because the Wimpy is actually not in many places um, nowadays. I don't know I don't know how many there are in the UK. There's one in Norwich. Is there one in Norwich? But, yeah, there's a Wimpy. We're going to the Wimpy later. Look, it's the Wimpy. Oh my God, I've gone back about 35 years. Look at the menu. I wonder if the menu's still the same. Oh my god. Should we go in the Wimpy, Atticus? I'm going okay, so we have ordered. I've gone for the classic Wimpy cheeseburger, but they now do sweet potato fries. And I have got, if you know, you know, some Wimpy special sauce. I have not had this sauce since I was probably 10. Oh yes. Atticus, what are we saying about the Wimpy? We've got extra chips, chips, and some chicken strips. Yes. And now I've got pancakes and ice cream with chocolate sauce, a cup of tea, and Atticus has got his Wimpy ice cream. He rates the Wimpy 10. Solid 10, isn't it? How good does this look? Simple, but oh, so good.
So we are back at Norfolk Woods now. We are back just in time. We're having a drink and we are going to play. What are we playing, Atticus? We're playing bingo. Atticus wants to have a game of bingo. Um, so they've got bingo on in the um, building behind me. Yeah. A few games of bingo. So. We're back at the lodge now. Bingo was good. Atticus really loved it. Um, we didn't win anything, but it was the taking part that counts. It was fun. So we've just come back to the lodge. We are chilling. It's about, it's just gone four. Atticus is watching some telly. I'm gonna sit and read a bit of my book. Um, have a nice cup of tea. Just chill. So I bought this book on holiday with me. It is the Sunday Times number one bestseller, Why Has Nobody Told Me This Before by Dr. Julie Smith. I actually finished um, Wrong Place, Wrong Time, which I mentioned in my May favorites, which you can watch down below. That book was one of the best books I've ever read. It was amazingly written. The plot was just, genius i can't recommend that book enough wrong place wrong time by gillian McAllister. i think it was amazing so i thought right okay we had a novel i like to turn it and now we've got like a self-help book type thing So good morning. Good morning. It is our last full day in Norfolk today. It's Thursday and we go home tomorrow morning. Um, so we are spending the day today in Norwich, somewhere I've never been. I've never been. Atticus has never been. Um, there's a castle, there's a big cathedral. We've also been on um, the outskirts. Been on the outskirts. To but, get to Great Yarmouth. Yeah, but never actually in Norwich. It's meant to be quite a buzzing place. So um, I'm castle. dressed a bit warmer today. I'll be honest, since I've been I in Norfolk, um, I've worn quite really a few cold, yeah. like dresses and stuff. And up till now, I like I've worn like thin linen shirts and dresses and blah, blah, blah. And I've been quite chilly. It hasn't been, the sun hasn't actually been out since we've been here. It hasn't been like freezing cold, obviously, because it's spring, but the sun hasn't been out. And I thought today, I just want to be comfy. I just want to feel a bit of warmth. So I've put on, I've got like a vest top underneath. I've got a hoodie. I've got my denim jacket. I've got trousers. We just want to be comfortable, don't we, Atticus, today? Atticus has got a long sleeve top on today. Um, so we're going to have a good explore around um, Norwich for our last full day. Um, so we're gonna go, I think we're gonna go to the castle first when we get there. Although parts of the castle are closed because they're um, restoring it and it's... Because it was built when Winnie and the Conqueror was killed. That's right, really, it really was not, It's not a wooden castle, it's a stone castle, but yeah. they're gonna restore it so... And it's meant to be finished at the end of this year. That's right. Um, we'll have a look down, is it the... Um, Oh, the Norwich lanes. It's like all and little streets the and, and the cathedral. Um, it's about 50 minute drive, yeah. so. It is now, what's it now? Nearly half past nine, so we best get going. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's go to Norwich.
castle, um, as I showed you in the clip, um, obviously they're restoring to it, how the castle it used to, be, to how it used to, how be, it when, used to be when William the Conqueror was king. When William the Conqueror was king. Come back and look at it when it's all finished. But today, apparently, the man did say to us there are um, parts of the castle that we can actually go in. Crazy, it's just so old, unbelievable. They're using the money from the National Lottery Heritage Fund to restore it. And it's going to it's cost... It's 13.5 million, was it, or something like yeah, that? Yeah, I'll turn you around. This is quite nice. You see the, the bridge. Come out the castle, um, the museums. That was the part we were allowed to go in. Um, I wasn't allowed to vlog in there. I did ask a couple of people, but um, people. not allowed in there. So well, really obviously good. I couldn't show you any of it, but it was good, wasn't it? Yeah, the last person had to ask like a supervisor. Yeah, um, it was good. There was lots of like um, paintings from the castle. There was a section all about the Gloucestershire, which was interesting, wasn't it, Atticus? Yeah. Um, oh, there was so much, so much. It was really, really good, really interesting. Um, wish I could have logged it, but sometimes you just can't and you know, you've got to abide by the rules when you are a vlogger, so that's fine. Yeah, we are now, it's warmed up a little bit, it's nice. We're going to go and find somewhere nice for lunch now. We're currently at what I think is called the Norwich Lanes, like all the little streets of independent shops and cafes, it's lovely, right up my street. Um, we've come to a place called Harriet's, um, Harriet's Tea Rooms. I've actually ordered myself an afternoon tea, oh yes, a proper afternoon tea with the scones and the cakes, ordered afternoon tea for one. I can't wait, I am buzzing for this. We have found this really cool, it's a Sue Ryder, it's vintage and retro. And I was just looking in the window and I have found the Cindy bathroom sink. My mum bought me this. Okay, I'm 48, it must be, I don't know, 40 years ago. I'm gonna buy it, I'm gonna buy it and I'm gonna put it in my drawer. For old times sake, because when I look at that, I'm just transported back. I am literally transported back. It's only £3.50. Look, I can't wait to show my mum this. Look at this. So I bought the Cindy sink. If you know, you know. Leave comment down below if you ever had one of these in your Cindy house. And I just said to ask her, you see the little plug? I used to spend ages putting the plug in, taking the plug out, pretending I was giving Cindy a wash, turning the taps. And I'd have all the little Cindy's toiletries on the Mommy shelf here. Mummy had Barbies also. I did. I got some vinyl back from the days when we'd go to Woolworths and get a single for 99p. Remember them days and put it on the record player. I got Human League, Human. I got um, Laura Branigan, Cell Control, seven inch, and then this cover, just this cover takes me back to my childhood. I actually remember going to Woolworths and buying this. Culture Club, do you really want to hurt me? If you know, you know. I also got this one, this cover takes me back. Do they know it's Christmas by Band-Aid? Seven inch. Oh yes. And these were literally like, that was two pounds. So I am trying Norfolk's famous coffee shop coffee. It is called Bread Sauce. Um, someone just recommended it to me. I've got a latte. 
um, and it is as good as they said. It is so, so good. think I'm gonna end the Norfolk vlogs here it's a lovely place to end it I hope you've enjoyed watching it has been wonderful um, the stay at Norfolk Woods um, you know just visiting new places it's been lovely it's one of the things we just love doing yeah um, so yeah what better place to end the vlog than Norwich Cathedral um, really hope you've enjoyed if you haven't watched vlog number one you can watch that down below we're gonna head back to Norfolk Woods um, we leave tomorrow morning so lots of packing tonight and getting things sorted um, but I really hope you've enjoyed coming along with us to Norfolk so we will see you again soon for another video bye